He's a skier. <laughs> no, he's converted now. We're I'm converted. I'm 100% converted. No, but we're uh, we're doing some product development, and Riley had a snowboard, so I figured I would uh, do some double checking. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> Looks good. Yeah, I think it's uh, it's really. I I guess we haven't showed <laughs> too much about this bag. <laughs> this is today's comment, by the way. It's yeah. I've seen a million questions uh, after I wore this pack when I was heli skiing and is that the new douche bag? And yes, it's one of the new products that are coming out. And we have uh, just received this sample a couple weeks ago. The prototype. Prototype. First sample, which is crazy, because usually first samples are like, ugh, like they look like a grocery shopping bag. So the fact that this is first sample is pretty crazy. So that is, I think, what I love the most about working with douche bags is that we work on a sample, I get the sample, I go heli skiing and use the bag for eight hours a day and try to find every little detail that I think could be better. For and, example. Okay, so just one example. Imagine you're up on the mountain and like, bam, there's an avalanche. Like you are so stressed that you wanna get your pack out and like make sure your buddy doesn't die. So then I was thinking, when you're out in the snow and the cold and everything, like finding zippers can sometimes take, uh, take a few extra seconds. So. I was just thinking like, what if you had orange or red zipper pullers on the pocket where you have your shovel? Mm, so <laughs> they're easier to find. You know, like these little mini details, but that I think shows that a product has really been analyzed and sort of perfected. Like one of the things I wanted, like I wanted a ski pack that looks, you know, less technical. So if I wanted to take this and fly to the mountain with it, I didn't want it to look like super, super hiking bag. I wanted to like look like something Riley would wear. Yeah. Would you wear it? I would absolutely wear it. But one thing that is pretty cool is that, you know, a waist strap, you know, you need it when you ski or snowboard or do anything. But if you're walking around on an airplane, it looks like super outdoor technical. So then we made a solution here that you can um, oh. just remove that. And then you have the chest strap that you can just put up like this. So you can kind of hide away a lot of it. So it's really fun. I'll show you more of this once we have a later sample. I'm not sure I was supposed to show it, but, yeah. but we <laughs> like sharing. Sharing's caring. So what I'm doing right here, um, you might have seen a lot of different things, is that we are working on the branding. So logos and all this. This is a team effort. We've done this a lot of times for a lot of different bags. Yeah, because <laughs> it's good. I mean, Marcus and Riley, they're stylish people. And I'm like a Justin Bieber wearing guy. <laughs> so. so it's good to ask for their opinion. Um, yeah, so that's sort of what we we're starting out the morning with trying to figure out logo sizes and then combining all the different uh, bags. Yep. And second question of the day, when is Douchebag going to restock their, their website? Mm -hmm. And I know that we've been out of stock and trust me, like last year we ordered so much we thought we'd have gear for three years ahead and then all oh, you guys bought too much stuff so we ran out mega quickly. So then we told the factory, you need to send us more real quick. And I guess they told the boat driver with all the bags to go a little too fast. Cause this is what happened to the boat. <laughs> and that is the actual boat where the douchebags are on. Yes, on but the big, on the big boat. On the big boat, yeah. yeah not not the small, small yeah, of course. <laughs> so on the big one, so they had to replace the ship and then uh, bring it back. But we should be restocked in uh, about a month or so. Perfect. Just so you know. <laughs> Like where you are trying, but when a boat crashes, you can't really do much. We'll let you know once it's out. But now you need to stop filming so I can finish this. Okay. So we can go uh, to Sammy's. To Sammy's. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Hello, Sammy's. <laughs> I mean, when we're in Europe, we have no chance to look at anything cool because they just have the standard stuff. So that's why when we come to LA, we have to come to Sammy's and look at all the radness. Cool there. stuff. It feels like it's like a, from Home Depot or something. But they don't sell it, do they? I don't know. I thought they recalled everyone. 
I thought so too. Yeah, they re they fell out of the sky. I read that they recalled all the. They recalled all drones. I didn't know that. Started selling again. Uh, do they have dollies and stuff here, or is that up or down? Oh, I think you mean like a dolly because you're gonna buy so much stuff. <laughs> <laughs> this sign. is like almost sort of where it all started. It did. This is where Riley brought me when I bought I mean, my first manual lens. And then that turned into Leica, and here we are with Reds and Sonys and <laughs> drones and... You came here and bought the Sony too. I think we need this. Get some crane you had shots. one of those. I had a crane. I, when I first had a video blog back in 2007, we had a crane. And a dolly. Crane. This is like 9,000 times better than ours. Do you want to switch jobs, Marcus? Like imagine the, the shots of the dogs in the morning with that. Hey guys, we gotta leave. So Why do we gotta leave? It's not good. Come on, you just look at it. Come on. Give it a I, try. I am looking at it. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. No 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 no. What do you mean no oh, no? No no no. What do you mean? Come here, come on. Stop you, with Do you have scissors? No 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 no. No, go down there, let me take a photo of you. <laughs> Just shoot, shoot, shoot me with it. No. Yeah. <laughs> I just sometimes wish I could be born more normal. And how much is the 85 one too? <laughs> Good king. <laughs> so this happened. What? I'm just checking out your bill. <laughs> He's over there rethinking hey, the, his whole the life The whole right idea now. with bills is that you don't look at them. Okay, so the idea was that we were going to get a wider lens for the red, so we can use that. Um, they didn't have the one we wanted. So then we tried on this 85 1.2, which is like magic. In it a is insane. Magic and it's crazy. Like, look how big that is. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Hey. Yeah. Yep. Awesome. Really um, awesome. But then you made the mistake of trying it on this. Yeah, and then I tried <laughs> it on the Canon 5D Mark IV, which Riley opened my eye for a little while ago. And then oh. I was like, I was missing the like SL to take photos because my Instagram's not killing it right now. I'm buying it for Yanni. So this is not this is not for me. Yanni, this is for you so that you can have many beautiful photos. And then we went upstairs and found a new tripod head, which is way smoother. Um, and then inside of this thing is a slider. <laughs> so we can shoot dogs and like slide. You just want to <laughs> shoot B-roll all day. No, I just want to be like Michael Bay. Shit, that type of stuff. Well, you need explosions and naked chicks then. You don't have either of those. That's your part. Yeah. Oh, okay, let's do it. <laughs> I, I'm feeling good about anything? myself. I didn't buy a single thing today. What is this now? A lens case? Oh, no. Oh, pilot fly. Da -da -da -da. Okay, so, success. Overall, super successful, except for the fact that it's never cheap to go to a camera store. Seeing him wander like this is not a good idea. Yoon. Stop wandering, stay close, come in. Yeah, but I'm realizing I need We need a leash on him. Hey, I need one of these. No, you don't. We need it. I have one at home, you can have it. Just let's go, come on. Come on. It's called passion. It's called passion for everything. And I wish you could turn it off sometime. Did he wander again? Yeah. Is this airport, like, approved? I actually think no. Yeah, because I carry all the camera stuff and you're walking around with an empty douche bag. Yeah, so we can fill up my douche bag so I carry more stuff. Yeah, but then when you go on like holidays and I'm stuck with all the stuff. Then oh yeah, that's true. No more holidays. <laughs> you either buy this or you don't have any holidays. Okay, let's ha let's take this. <laughs> <laughs> this is perfect, you look yeah, at it. Look yeah, you have a side handle, you have a lock, like you have like yeah stuff. And yep, then, this is then, perfect. Thumbs up. And then when you're on a holiday, I'm usually with him, and then I'll have to carry everything. So you should definitely get it. Yes. Um, approved. Looks great. But like, look at this guy. Oh yeah, this is a really nice bag as well. <laughs> did I mention I'm a bag nerd? Yes, you did. He's had Red Bulls all day, no food. <laughs> like, how do you it's live? Like, how do you actually walk? Look at this wild creature. Yeah. <laughs> we are still waiting for the guy to pay, right? Like, you know, you're we not waiting. We're waiting for, waiting for you. Us. They're exactly the same. What are you doing? <laughs> you're comparing identical bags. <laughs> <laughs> no, they've got different pockets. Like this, this guy doesn't have a laptop pocket on the outside. Then get the one with the laptop pocket. Fits 17-inch laptop. You are set, my friend. No, it's a camera bag, so people will pay expensive for to protect their expensive gear. Well, did they pay extra to like have ugly bags too? Yeah, because that's hideous. <laughs> Seven.
<laughs> we have to bleep that. God, six Confirm. <laughs> Whoa! What happened there? <laughs> and see. Good job, guys. That is like, yeah, thank you so much for the help. We're gonna try to not come back soon. Alright. <laughs> thank, thank you. I gotta no, nope, no. Nope. What about the fishing nope. vest? Walk. All the pockets. Wasn't that bright when we walked in? Yes. Wasn't it like morning when we walked in? Thank I you. Kinda, I think I kinda lost track of time. <laughs> Yes, 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 yes. I say variety is overrated. Italian? Sorry to say it again, but this is the best pizza in the world. You get hungry from like all that shopping. <laughs> I'm surprised that thing isn't melted. <laughs> Thank you. We're not done yet though. I have one more surprise in store before we go home. Spin it. Golden spoon. That's all you guys, I'm gonna diet. <laughs> That's all Riley, I'm gonna diet as well. Come on, it's on me. <laughs> Thank you. I wouldn't steer you. Oh, it's warm. Oh yeah. Thank you. Thanks for the help, guys. <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> How much stuff did you get? Just good stuff. It's like late Christmas. Look at this new tripod. It's like, you know, how girls look at Gucci bags and we're like, Okay, so we're gonna be the first daily vlog to use a slider on a <laughs> daily basis. This is YouTube vlogging in 2016. Reds and sliders. Oh, I'm excited. Come look. Oh, I see. I'm gonna see. Come on, come on. Come on, <laughs> come on Walker. Come look. That lens is insane. The lens is crazy, but I'm really digging the slider idea too. Yeah, of course. Okay. Good job. Totally worth it. Let me see. Like. Look at that reveal. Whoa. Wow! <laughs> Boy snipe? Good job. Yeah. That was really cool actually. Yeah, like, what a good idea, right? Yeah, super good idea. <laughs> Look at that. We are going to say ciao from LA and we'll see everybody tomorrow. Ciao. ciao. Cheers. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs>